400 years after the last king was driven from the city, the Republic of Rome rules many nations, but cannot rule itself. The city is constantly roiled by conflict between the common people and the nobility. Power is shared and order maintained by two soldiers, old friends, Gnaeus Pompey Magnus and Gaius Julius Caesar. Once, Pompey was acknowledged by all to be the greater man, but for the last eight years, while Pompey has kept the peace in Rome, Caesar has waged a war of conquest in Gaul that has made him ever more rich and popular. The balance of power is shifting, and the nobility have grown fearful. Though of noble blood himself, Caesar stands with the common people. A man like that, an aristocrat with soldiers, money, and the love of the people, might make himself king. Reform! Legionary Titus Pullo is a hero of the 13th Legion. But look at him now. Justice knows every man's number. He has committed a terrible sacrilege, and he will pay for it with his life as will any man here who breaks the law. Brawlers and drunkards will be flogged. Thieves will be strangled. Deserters will be crucified. Is that it? I was just beginning to enjoy myself. Before you, Vercingetorix, son of Keltil, chieftain of the tribe of the Averni, commander of the rebel stronghold of Elysia, king of all the Gauls. What would you have of him? <laughs> 